In this video, we are going to draw an isometric of this 110 volt power plug. All right, we first have to look at the proportions. This is one unit wide. This is approximately three quarters of a unit deep. And it is one, two, three units long. So we are going to draw it so it sort of looks like that when we are finished. All right, let's get started. What I've done is to have drawn the horizontal vertical and the isometric axes of this. Notice they're 30 degrees. Notice I divided these into thirds. I'm going to now erase this. And let's put in our units. Let's assume that this is one unit. And I'm going to now draw a line parallel to this axis over here. And then I'm going to draw a line like that too. And make sure that these lines are parallel and they do not converge. Here's a one unit wide. One. We have one unit wide, we have three units long, but now we need three quarters deep. So how do we do that? Very simply, divide our square, which is a diamond here, into quadrants and divide this one quadrant again, and that is our three quarters. So this is the bottom edge of the electrical power plug. Now I'm going to draw this and we will discuss it when I am finished.
Okay, that is an isometric of this 110 volt power plug. It's like this. Notice a few things. Notice that it is three dimensional. It has the same scale on all three axes. But it does not have true shape. I added some shading here because the sun comes from this direction right here. And then also I added some lines here to show that this is a reflective surface. Remember, this does not have to be an exact drawing. What this does is this represents the structure of it so that you can visually convey, convey the information to your viewer. Thank you. That is the end of this video. Thank you very much.